Welcome, gentlemen. You are looking at the new deputy of Pecos, Texas. After drifting around Texas for a few years, I, Jim Miller, fell in with a group of like-minded outlaws who could support my business endeavors. And I found the perfect base from which to build a criminal empire. What about the sheriff? I'll take care of Bud Frazier. He won't bother you. We play our cards right. They'll never solve another crime in this town again. <laughs> Bud Frazier had no business being sheriff. I guess that's why he hired me to put some muscle in the sheriff's office. That's how I became the last person anyone suspected when a crime wave hit Pecos. Bud Fraser quickly found out it was the worst mistake of his life because Jim more or less let crime run rampant around the city because he was controlling the crime. He'd become a godfather of sorts. Pecos was a sweet setup. We were rustling all the horses and cattle we could take with impunity. At first, we had our run of the place, did pretty much as we pleased. Well, for a little while, anyway. Until I shot a Mexican prisoner to keep him quiet about two mules I had stolen. Even I couldn't talk my way out of that one. Supposedly, this guy had information about him stealing the two mules, and this was typical Miller to kill witnesses. He comes in and, and tells Frazier that I had to shoot the prisoner for trying to escape. And Frazier really doesn't buy that at all. What the hell happened, Jim? Little bastard made a break for it. There's nothing I could do. Killing that eyewitness kept me out of jail, but my lawman days were over, for the moment. And so when he's accused of all of this, he's fired by um, uh, Bud Frazier, and of course Miller doesn't take that very well. I had blown the perfect cover, all because of a couple of damn mules. But there was no way I was gonna let some pesky two-bit sheriff get in the way of business. Bud had to go out of town for a while, and when he did, uh, vice and crime ran rampant under Miller's reign. It was convenient timing. We kept up our operations while Bud was away and planned a nice little homecoming party for his return. 